is around what has been the market and challenges for the deer. I guess that's it's quite a broad scope, right? It could be versus two, three years ago. It could just be within the last six to 12 months. What have you seen that is impacting the market heavily right now that you guys are having to deal with on behalf of your clients? The buyers changed. How the buyer buy buys has drastically changed. It's a buyer's market. It's like when you're buying a house, right? It's either a buyer's market or a seller's market. And if you're a seller and it's a seller's market, you can basically make whatever terms you want to accept. And the buyer's going to figure out how to come and meet those terms. And on the other side, if it's a buyer's market, you're probably going to take a pretty big hit as a seller. I can speak from experience. We certainly did. Hurt like hell. But that's where we are. We're in a complete buyer's market right now from a B2B tech marketing world, whether it's SaaS or a more enterprise product. And it's because they have a lot of choice, maybe too much choice. I don't know. But they don't want cold calls. They don't want to be bothered. They want you to just leave them alone and let them do their job. And they will raise their hand when they're ready and they have a problem. And this has completely shifted how we have to market. Cold outreach, I'm going to I'm gonna call it and say it's dead. I think a lot of people probably still disagree with me. They're holding on to it for dear life. But the sooner you can accept that cold outreach is dead, the sooner you can move on and get on with your life and get back to some of the basics, which is brand awareness and demand gen and these things that we put on hold and said, it's all about the leads and we got to do bottom of the funnel and we have to do white papers and we have to gate everything. And those days are gone. It's time to let the buyer give as much information as she possibly can, be as helpful as humanly possible, and then be there when they're ready to say, I have specific questions, I'm ready to make a buying decision, and now I need to talk to a person. That's really been the big shift since I would say, I think it started right before accelerated it, and now it's here to stay. Interesting. So I guess combining that, what's the top piece of marketing advice right now that seems to be working well, either for you as a business or for your clients that kind of combats that situation? 